Today, I'm going to share a look at my August sales at Adobe stock, and the news is encouraging. Some great info I'm going to share on my sales data and what were my hottest selling topics. So you might be able to focus on some of these and drive your sales as well. So let's dive in. Overall earnings for the month of August were solid. A total of $1,896.79. That's good for a variety of reasons. First, it's the summer slump. And while it's a bit down on July's total of $1,954.77, it's to be expected. August is always a little bit lower than July for me. Now, the better comparison is looking at July 2023 versus July 2022. I earned $1,649 a year ago. So this year's total of $1,896 is about $250 higher or 15% increase. To me, that's a solid result because I estimate in the past 12 months, I've grown my portfolio at Adobe stock by about 5%. So a 15% rise in earnings from a year ago, while my portfolio only rose 5%, is a great result as far as I'm concerned. Another positive comparison for me is my year-to-date total. From January through August of this year, I earned $15,827 at Adobe stock compared to 15684 the prior January through August. So a smaller increase there, but I'll take it, especially when you consider how most of the other agencies are showing declines overall. So it's nice to see Adobe stock continuing to show growth. In fact, it's one of the top 10 reasons I give for Adobe stock being the best agency, and you can watch the video by clicking the link above. Another interesting data point from August is that I earned $10.16 from AI-generated images. I had uploaded about 10 AI images as a test, so earning $10 from 10 AI images is not bad at all. That suggests that if I can get about 1,000 images generated by AI tools like MidJourney into my port, I might start earning about $1,000 or about a dollar a month for each of those images uploaded. So of course, some will sell better than others, but that's the average I'm seeing, at least from this early test in August. Now, it also depends, of course, on whether the subject matter is of equally high commercial value and the amount of competition stays about the same. With the number of people jumping into submitting AI images lately, if competition is surely going to go up in the months to come. I just have to hope that they're all creating things like abstract backgrounds or sports cars, other things that I'm not doing and I think aren't as high commercial value. So far, I've created AI images on the same high selling topics that have done well for me in photos and illustrations. So I feel like I have a leg up here. And that's a good segue into what I want to cover next. What topics performed well for me in August? Like I do each month, I downloaded a CSV file from my Adobe Stock dashboard, and I put my sales into buckets by topic to see which ones are the hottest selling topics for the month, and here are the results. My highest performing topic for the month of August at Adobe Stock was raffles, contests, winning some kind of a prize, typically a high-performing subject for me. My second highest performing topic has been one that's been performing well for me for the past year or so, and that's diversity, equity, and inclusion, a hot topic for organizations these days, uh, dealing with employees and customers, creating a welcoming workplace. Third is one I didn't see so much last month, but the idea of being prepared, running drills, just being ready for any kind of a situation. Fourth, I had a number of downloads of a single image that was a background of a crumpled piece of paper. I don't have a heck of a lot of backgrounds in my portfolio, but this one performed well for some reason in August. My fifth highest selling theme was new, the idea of something being new, an improvement over something from the past. Number six was again on my list from last month. That's the idea of being the perfect candidate for a job, hiring a new candidate for an open position. Number seven was the concept of integrity, having a strong reputation and using that to advance yourself in your career or have some kind of success in your life. My number eight top selling topic was automation, the idea of using new robotics and other types of technologies to automate processes for a business. Number nine, similar to number six, another employment topic, this being a new hire, so bringing a new person into an organization to fill a job. And number 10, another one that's similar to another theme on the list, this one being belonging, the idea of being welcomed into an organization and feeling like you truly belong there. So those were the top 10 selling themes for me in August at Adobe Stock. I'm including a much longer list of about 35 or so top selling themes from my analysis of my August downloads at Adobe. That's going to be in the next edition of my newsletter. If you haven't already signed up for that, I put a link in the description below. How was your August? Let me know in the comments and be sure to sign up for this channel. If you haven't already, you'll get all the latest learnings and earnings news from my experience in Microstock. So until then, best of luck with earnings and sales, and I'll see you soon.